Hey y'all, so today I am getting ready to go to the farmer's market and it's kind of cold, it's 36 degrees out here and I don't like to be sick so I wrap up. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't really have a lot to say as far as what's going on, I'm just starting this vlog off to re-up for the week. Today is day 6. Today is day six. Um, for breakfast, I had some grapes and I had an avocado with some Himalayan sea salt sprinkled on top of it. That's it. It is 11.53. I did drink some water. So I need to go and re-up for the week so I won't relapse <laughs> and um, eat horrible foods. If I'm prepared, then I can stick with it. Instead of saying, oh, I need to go, I need to go, I'll go tomorrow, then I'm, I know it's not any food in there or any food that I want to eat or any food to make anything really out of. So it's like I'll just wait and wait until I really don't have anything else and then I just eat horribly whatever's in the refrigerator that the carnivores are eating in my home. So I'm going to go ahead and re-up real quick and then I'll be back. I probably, I don't think I'm going to vlog as far as what... I got but yeah today is day six and I've been doing pretty good I haven't really been craving like as much as I thought I was gonna have cravings like just everything sweet all kind of um like pastries and I love cupcakes I love the little sugar cookies that you get from Walmart with the icing on top I love those those are so good to me so sweet but I haven't been craving anything lately, so I'm happy about that. My skin, this is natural sunlight. It's 11.54 in the morning, so this is what my skin looks like out in public. or well, out in the sunlight. Um, it doesn't look too bad facing forward, but just on the sides, it's just, I hate it. I'm just ready to get this cleared up. Um, it is that time of the month, so... I have a pimple right here and I have this one that's hopefully healing but those are the only two that I've gotten well this one really is one of the only ones the only new ones that I've gotten so far so um yeah I'm going to go ahead and do what I got to do and I'll be back Hey y'all, I am back from the farmer's market and I spent $127. Hopefully this food is going to last me for like two weeks. Um, I went a little less than a week ago. Last time I went was Sunday, but I wanted to go today because I didn't want to run out of food, like I said earlier. So I just went ahead and got it. But um, if I'm going to be paying like $100 plus dollars a week... This is not the diet for me. Like, I'm not going to be able to keep doing this for a long time. Now, for the rest of the month, I probably can hang tight. But um, if this is something that I, that I may end up having to do indefinitely, I can't afford that. Um, growing my own food is not an option because I live in an apartment. So, tell me where I'm going to grow some vegetables hmm. so um i'm kind of just trying to figure figure my way out right now um figure out what is going to be best for me i've been researching a whole lot like a whole lot and it's just you come across so many things i feel like i'm trying to self-diagnose myself but of course when you're not when you're not going the traditional route where you just go get a cream and rub it on your face um though i've i've done that a time or two before like way up years ago um i may not have been consistent with it which i don't i really don't know but when you're not going the traditional route it's kind of harder because you have to wait and see what yields results for you so whereas me going raw vegan for a month i may need to go much longer to see whether or not this is benefiting my skin because you know you just 
you have to take the time to actually see what's what's good and what's not um i'm kind of debating whether or not i want to incorporate like a cooked meal a week or something like that rewarding myself not cooked meat or anything like that a cooked vegan meal like maybe some cooked chickpeas and rice i was really thinking about a curry dish because i kind of want I'm kind of in the mood for some curry. I'm just, of course, when you, you're doing something, you kind of want to rush the progress because, like, I just want to know, is this going to work? Is it not going to work? That's all I want. That's it. Um, of course, the dark marks are, they're really irritating and frustrating because a pimple can come. It can be on your face in a day and then go down. Maybe mine take, like, if, I don't accidentally pop them like by washing my face too vigorously it'll last for a good four days probably four to five days like this one here has been here for a minute and I'm waiting on it to go down I haven't done anything with it um, <clears throat> so when they go down regardless of whether you pop them or whatever they still leave a mark and that's frustrating but um yeah i've been going strong it's only it's barely been day seven now i have been craving popcorn i really really want some popcorn not like not the microwavable popcorn the popcorn kernels i make my own popcorn so like i just get coconut oil heat that up put the popcorn kernels in the bottom and then let them pop and then use of course the seasoning that comes from walmart but um i'll use that or i can use i've done like in the beginning i used nutritional yeast and some bragg's aminos for a natural flavor but you can't eat popcorn when you're raw vegan so i'm trying trying to figure that out um i'm just trying to figure it out you guys um if you have any suggestions if you are a raw vegan if you have acne and you're suffering from it um or if you had acne and you changed your diet or in any type of way and it helped let me know please leave a comment Be feel free to send me a message um i'm all for all of that like any suggestions other than what to put on my face top topically i really don't need those suggestions because i've tried any everything um literally i will maybe i'll make a video of products i've tried or something like that i don't know <laughs> maybe i'll just wait until my skin clears up it's gonna clear up soon soon um but yeah if you all have any positive feedback for me let me know so i can know that i'm not the only person out here struggling which is why i wanted to put this series on my channel because when you live in a world and you go out and it's like nobody you see is suffering from this like nobody I see in person has this problem it's, it's hard but anyway yeah let me know if you all suffer <laughs> from what I'm suffering from okay bye